Hey guys, just want to give you a quick update. Uh, as you can see, I've pulled the, do the door off. Remove the fender and this cowl piece. They were just kind of being held on by some a couple of bolts that were just hand hand threaded in, like this one. Uh, working on the hinges. This plate's still in here. We got a got a, some problems here in the uh, door pillar. So that's, we're gonna have to cut that out and replace this. And uh, this is some custom work here that somebody's done. It's welded on there, so I'm not sure what I'm going to get into when I open that up or when I get this hinge off, but we're about to find out. Alright, got the hinge off. Looks like this has just been... Somebody welded this on and probably tacked this threaded bit from the back side, so that's going to have to come out of there. More fun! Alright, this plate must have been welded on the outside of the, uh, the pillar here and uh, evidently still attached here, but it's not welded on this side, so it's just a little corner of it holding in here. But So I'm going to clean this up a little bit, uh, stick and kind of reach up in there and see, see what kind of rust we're dealing with inside. Oh, I forgot my gloves. There's our plate. And this must be what uh, holds it in so it can slide back and forth. I might be able to save this plate. Otherwise, I'll have to have a new one made. Alright, I've got this piece here that uh, makes up the bottom of this uh, pillar here. Uh, it's not. It's just surface rust up in here, so you get up a little bit higher, which looks pretty bad. So, not a whole lot holding this uh, door sill on here, so maybe I'll uh, see what's involved in getting this off. Then I can get a better idea of exactly where this goes, so I know how much of a piece I have to make here. This rocker panel was originally held on at the factory by welds here, which are obviously gone. And some welds back in here. Uh, let's see if we can pull up, one of the, pull up a diagram on that. So front, back. Now it looks like uh, there may still be something here holding it in. But now we've got some screws or some rivets in here holding it holding it in, so maybe I can knock those out easy. I'm gonna, gonna grind the paint off, see if I can find those uh, find some of those spot welds. There they are. I don't know if you can see that on the camera. We got spot welds. Never drilled out a spot well before. Still haven't by a look at it. Oh, 
that spot weld up in there still hold it. Got the rocker panel loose from here. Still a little bit of up here, it's gonna have to come off. But the trouble is, this is the edge of what's left of the rocker panel. It's still attached to what's left of the floor. This is supposed to be a solid piece through here, but it's all coming as one, so uh, I'm gonna try a little bit more to get these two bits separated, but if not, it's all gonna have to come off as a single piece. Not a big deal since it's all getting replaced. So I wound up just cutting through the bit of the floor that was holding it in place so the whole thing came off as a unit. So here's one end. Fortunately I have that replacement piece too. This is the other end. It's full of, this uh, cab support is full of dirt. Here are the bolts that hold, looks like this uh, fender fender support on. That can be pulled off. It looks like it goes more or less whoops, more or less right in that area. So it looks like I've got a pretty good section to fill in. And I've got to fill I've got to fix that part too. You can also see here what's left of the old floor pan. It's supposed to be up in there, kind of in that general vicinity. This is, the, like I said earlier, is the floor support. It's not looking too promising at the moment either. Here's the inside. Here's the inside of our rocker panel. That the, the, there's the back of the cab. And that's what was there. That was right, isn't it? Yeah. So that was there. Let's see about getting that fender mount off of there sprayed some liquid wrench on the back side of these bolts here and uh, I'll tap them with a hammer to see if I can get them loosened up at all. Oh wow. That might be salvageable. Oh, well, that's not so good, is it? That's probably about all the fun I can stand for one day. Yeah, I've got a bit of a mess to clean up, so I better get to work on that. Thanks for watching. See you guys next time.